Decade-long water leak on Oahu's north shore is in the process of being fixed. Officials say one million gallons of water was being wasted each month at Dillingham Airfield. Eleven years later, the red tape has finally come down. Mickey Schenfeld explains. Ownership of Dillingham Airfield has been an issue itself for over a decade. The Army owns the land, but it's leased out by the state. North Shore leaders have known about the leak for 11 years. This is so critical. Every month since 2012, we've been losing more than a million gallons of drinking water out in Molokulea because of a leaking pipe underground at Dillingham Airfield. Uh, water is so important. We're in a time right now where our islands are facing drought. Maui is dry. We are dry. Look around. We need water, so we need to preserve it where we can. I'm standing above where those leaking pipes are located. They run parallel with the airstrip and go through these bushes that you see behind me. And it provides fresh water to Mokali'i residents. And for comparison, an Olympic-sized swimming pool holds about a half million gallons worth of water. So over time, about 240 Olympic-sized swimming pools worth of fresh drinking water has been wasted. Last week, the state and Army met at Dillingham. The Army says leaks aren't always easy to find, and they weren't sure where or how many leaks were underground. So the new technology of the leak detection, identifying very exact locations, allows the team to come in and excavate in previously disturbed areas right on top of the pipe and do what is an emergency repair, whereas before when we did not know exact locations, it was really a wholesale repair of the water system out there that we were looking at, and that was a much more extensive. The Army says improved teamwork and technology helped move the repair forward. And through this week, we'll get it done. We start, we'll start looking at those lines to see if there's other areas that we need to address, and if so, we'll do it at the same time. But we'll make sure that, we, that after this week is done, we'll finish up the repairs that are necessary to that line. Sniffin says archaeologists will be on site throughout the repair. Senator Awa hopes the improved partnership can be utilized to save an additional 11 million gallons of water at Kaneohe Marine Base. He says the state hasn't approved a military request for repurposed water for their golf course, but hopes the Mokali'ia repair shows the two agencies can work together. We'll follow up once the repair is complete. Nikki Schoenfeld, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.